Been already in custody, accused of robbing a man of his Rolex watch at a Miami Beach hotel, is now facing even more charges today. Local 10 News reporter Terrell Fournay is live in Miami to let us know what else she's being accused of doing. Terrell. And detectives Christie are certain that this woman is a serial robber. She's been connected to two additional crimes here in the city of Miami, and it appears she doesn't work alone. Liliana Venegas back in court again for a second time this week, accused of drugging and stealing from an unsuspecting Miami man. Affidavit, you're charged with two counts of strong arm robbery, two counts of food or water poisoning, and grand theft. The crime apparently happened last month, say cops. The 24 year old Colombian native and a female accomplice met the victim at a bar on South Beach and followed him back to his downtown Miami apartment. The women accused of stealing $30,000 worth of jewelry, including a $25,000 Rolex. I've spoken with my client. She's denying these allegations. In fact, she's claiming she's been victimized in, these, in all of these cases. A Canadian tourist says he too was a victim of Venegas just last weekend. The man was at a bachelor's party at Nikki Beach on South Beach when he met the woman. She went back with him to his motel room at the Lowe's Hotel. He woke up as the woman left in a hurry, he says with this pricey Rolex. The man called cops who arrested Venegas and Francisco Trujillo, who picked up the woman in an attempt to flee. Now cops are looking for this woman, the suspected accomplice, seen on the left with a large tattoo on her shoulder. She is blonde, 5'3 to 5'4, and between 20 and 25 years old, and also weighs about 130 pounds. And so the whereabouts of that woman unknown at this point. So if you have any information, certainly give police a call. Meanwhile, the Vegas can post bond, but she'll need another hearing to prove that the funds used for that bond money are legitimate. Reporting live from Miami, I'm Terrell Fournay, Local 10 News.